As the holiday season approaches, the Santa Clarita Valley is getting into the festive spirit with the first annual Jingle Fest. The festival filled with guests and vendors left and right, offering something for people of all ages. I think that this town just needs a little more live music. We got a band playing and uh, to support local artists, for sure. I started off as a vendor myself and supporting local is good. So 230 vendors and a lot of people came to shop. Whether it be face painting, line dancing, or just looking for a fatigue to get some early holiday shopping done, the Jingle Fest is giving back to the community in a big way. Having these boutiques allows all those people who found hobbies and um, their art that they love, it allows us to actually continue doing it because we can now sell it and afford to just keep on doing what we love. Food, music, and entertainment. This year's Jingle Fest is almost in full effect. But this line behind me is not for no reason. Guests line up for a chance to visit this holiday's biggest guest. And I do it for one reason. I do it for the children. I do it for all the boys and girls. And I try to make everyone happy when I, when I talk with them and, 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 and everything. And that, that's about it. So now we're going to be, uh, well, I'm everywhere right now, okay? Well, thank you, everyone. Thank you, Santa Clarita. With all the momentum from the event, Tammy and her crew are looking to make Jingle Fest an annual occurrence. For Canyons News, I'm Darius Burkow.